Hello everyone, I'm Shilpi Mangavasti and I welcome you all to our exciting series of Piran Sathi lessons. As you all know, Special Sathi has introduced quick hands-on bite-sized lessons featuring the industry experts, specifically designed for busy parents who are always on the go and looking for some crash core tips to make their lives a bit easier. Today we are presenting real, uh, ready with the uh, third uh, lesson in hands-on Avaaz lesson series with a fantastic resource person of special Sathi, Prashanti. She is here to share some effective and practical ways to master the Avaaz app, a valuable tool, especially for many non-verbal kids and their parents. In earlier sessions, we have seen exploring Avaaz app with the tap, creating folders and editing them, exploring Avaaz app through different categories, creating some new ones, and today we're going to learn description of various things using a Vaz app. So without further ado, Prashanti, you may proceed now. Uh, hello, everyone. So as uh, Shilpi had already described, today we are going to learn description of the things. Um, so today I only took the description of things. Next time we can take uh, you know the description of the people, how they look and everything. Because uh, this uh, adjectives learning, adjectives learning to describe is something very important skill. Uh, if you are looking for, you know, writing and uh, the stuff. So when I say like, like, you know, the door is like, I have few worksheets, which I again downloaded from Twinkle. Twinkle is a fantastic website. If you can take a subscription, that would uh, be very useful for the, you know, uh, for the pur purpose of doing your lesson plans and everything. So without much delay, I'll enter into the worksheets. So uh, let me show you uh, the first worksheet. So here you have the boxes. Okay. So in general cases, what we will say, the box is say full, say full. If the child has problem with saying full, it's quite difficult for him, although he might have the necessary vocabulary in that, right? So instead of using all, uh, you know, the verbal things, you can even use your avas. So let's see how you can use avas for this. So the first thing is, you know that box is full. Box is, okay, box is full. So for this, Again, our major, major uh, folder is always advanced. Advanced. And here you have describe. Describe. Okay. So in the describe folder, since here you are talking about quantity, the box is full. So you can go to quantity. quantity. And you can say the box is full. Full. Okay, so this way the child will not get irritated, right? It is easy for him also to understand the vocabulary and everything. So next one in the worksheet is the elephant is. So when we say uh, the elephant is, we say big, big, big. So instead, just go back and we are talking about the size of the elephant. So we'll go to the size. Size. And we will say elephant is big. big. Next one. Here, the pencil is, right? It can be long or short. Again, it's the same, you know, uh, it comes under size. So if you wish, you can go back or you can come back again. Here, Sorry. size and the pencil is short. Short. See how nicely you can, uh, you know, do the lessons for uh, this type of things. And the giraffe is, obviously, it's a size. So we'll say tall. tall. And you can even go to sporty. I have those in other things. Uh, so I think here, That's appearance. Nice. Uh, appearance doesn't have it. I have saved in my folders. So you can even go for spotty. So this is one worksheet. Uh, then we have something called, okay, if you wish to add more adjectives, the door is, uh, the door is. 
So you can go with the color of the door, right? So color right. red. red. All are there in the described folder. So let me again show you the path for the described folder. Home. We are in the home page. Then we will go to the advanced. Advanced. In the advanced, you have described. Describe. And in the described, you have all the other things, right? The door is color red. 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 Suppose your aim is to say the door is rectangle in shape, then you can go to shapes. Shapes. Rectangle. rectangle. See, you can have multiple uh, attributes for a single thing, right? It's not necessary that you should only go for uh, uh, what we will say, uh, the color or something. Okay. Uh, the next is the snail is. So here we are talking about snail. So snail is slow right so we are talking about speed again go back come to the speed folder speed. and you can show slow slow this is how easy it gets so instead of forcing the child say this say this say this it's all it's quite easy right next you have the sun is. It is hot. So you can go to appearance. Appearance. There's bright. You bright. can say bright. You don't think here I have hot. So you can say the sun is bright. That is also one attribute. So based on your worksheets, you can also create messages. So these are a few examples that I can, uh, I could think of for the you know, um, uh, for the description, uh, you can even go something for if the child is big, elder. So here you have like, there's an umbrella. It You can go for group, action, place, parts, looks like unique. This is a worksheet uh, uh, I've downloaded from teachers by teachers. So this one, it is a higher order thing. So might be we can do it later since it's a bit size thing. So let's go with the basic one uh, that I have just shown you. Okay. Uh, please uh, share your reviews and uh, your feedback on the YouTube link. Thank you so much. Over to Shilpi now. Yeah, thank you so much Prashanti for sharing today's lesson plan. And uh, of course, uh, there are few people who are commenting on our YouTube channel. And thank you so much for sharing the feedback. We are looking forward for more and more feedbacks about this lesson plan on AVAS. So thank you, Prashanti, for your time. And we'll see you, thank you next you week. See. Yeah, we'll yeah. see everyone next week. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye.